Welcome to my channel everyone. Today we prepared SKSE plugins that will make your play more convenient. From animations to navigation, these are the hidden gems that will make your Skyrim more convenient. So don't hesitate any longer and let's start this video. Did you know that there is actually an HKX animation file that handles all movement in the game? While numerous HKX files are involved in the animation of actors, we often don't know exactly what those HKX files are. Sometime, with many animations installed, there are too many HKX files, and there are many cases where we don't remember which file the animation is output from later. In this case, it takes too much time to open and search for each one. But would you believe that there is a way to solve this problem precisely? That's where the show animation command comes in. This SKSE plugin allows you to check which animation is currently being used through the console command. Sometimes when customizing an animation, you want to get rid of the bad animation the player is using, but often you don't know which file the HKX file is in. In this case, if you use the show animation command, there is no need to open and find the files one by one. Have the player use the animation, open the console window, click on the character, and press SA. At this point, you will be able to see what animation your player is using. But what if you need to find the exact location of the file? This is where the HKX Poser program comes in. By using this program together with the Show Animation command, you will be able to find the exact location of the file. Simply search for the file name of the HKX file you just checked using the SA console command. When the search is complete, you will see a number of HKX files with the same name. At this point, open the HKX Poser, and an ugly mannequin character will appear. Click and drag the HKX file to the mannequin, and you can check the actual motion of the file in real time without running Skyrim. Some may think that these programs are not necessary, but sometime with many animations installed, there are too many HKX files, and there are many cases where we don't remember which file the animation is output from later. In this case, it takes too much time to open and search for each one. That's why I highly recommend using the Show Animation command and HKX Poser together, which I have introduced to you today. Have you ever had a hard time entering complex console commands one by one? Have you ever resented Trollhead for forgetting a word while typing? Don't do that now. I would like to introduce SKSE plugin to solve this problem. Console++ is SKSE plugin to adds copy-paste into console and caches console commands between game sessions. To use Console++, simply open the console in-game by pressing the tilde key. You will notice that the console has a different look and feel than the vanilla one. You can now copy text from the clipboard to the console by pressing Ctrl plus V. The copied text will be pasted at the cursor position, just like standard copy-paste. You can also use the arrow keys to navigate through your previous commands, which are saved to file and restored upon starting a new game instance. The default limit for command history is 50 commands, but you can change this in the configuration file. Another useful feature is the command history. Console++ automatically saves the commands you've entered and allows you to navigate through them using the arrow keys. This is a huge time saver if you need to repeat a command or if you've forgotten a command you entered previously. Console++ is a simple but effective mod that improves the console functionality in Skyrim Special Edition. It makes using the console easier and more convenient, especially for modders and testers who need to use it frequently. If you are looking for a mod that enhances your console experience, I recommend giving Console++ a try. When replaying the Skyrim, have you ever wanted to skip dialogue you've already seen before? Didn't you want to speed up the game and save valuable time by skipping right. unnecessary dialogues? Elgin? Now it is possible. Avoid annoying or repetitive conversations you don't care about. Instantly, Skip Dialogue NG is a mod for Skyrim Special Edition that allows you to skip most of the dialogue directed to the player character right. instantly. To I'll use Instantly Skip Dialogue right NG, simply press the spacebar or the left mouse button when a dialogue song. starts. The mod Our will skip the dialogue instantly, without any delay or animation. You can still see the subtitles and choose your dialogue options if you want to. The mod works with most of the dialogue in the game, except for some scripted scenes that cannot be skipped. 
As mentioned earlier, Instantly Skip Dialogue is a simple but effective mod that allows you to skip most of the dialogue directed to the player character instantly. It is a great mod for anyone who wants to have more control over their dialogue experience in Skyrim Special Edition. With its easy installation, simple usage, and time-saving benefits, it's no wonder this mod has become so popular among Skyrim players. Whether you're playing through the game for the first time or the tenth, this mod is definitely worth checking out. Skyrim gamepad players, haven't you ever felt uncomfortable using one of your precious pad keys for a useless weight? However, have you ever hesitated because you couldn't remove the weight key from the pad? Don't suffer anymore. Weight Menu Redirected is a simple but powerful mod that makes the weight menu only able to open inside the tween menu. This means that you can use the weight button for other purposes outside menu mode, such as activating other mods that use custom keys. To use Weight Menu Redirected, you don't need to do anything else. The mod will automatically make the weight menu only open when you are inside the tween menu, which is the menu that shows up when you press the start button on your gamepad. This means that you can now use the weight button for other purposes outside menu mode, such as activating other mods that use custom keys. For example, you can now use the weight button as a separate power attack key, a dodge key, or even a sprint key. The possibilities are endless, and it's up to you to decide how to customize your gamepad controls. With Weight Menu Redirected, you can truly take control of your Skyrim gameplay experience. Are you tired of feeling lost in Skyrim due to too many quest markers? Do you only activate one quest because you dislike the clutter of too many quest markers? Today, I want to introduce you to the Compass Navigation Overhaul mod that can solve these problems. Compass Navigation Overhaul adds quality of life improvements to the compass seen in games such as God of War and Horizon Zero Dawn. It outputs the distance to the quest marker in real time on the top of the compass. In addition, Compass Navigation Overhaul outputs the contents of the corresponding quest mark under the compass and also outputs a separate message in the upper left corner. The vanilla Skyrim compass only added a quest mark to the compass and had no idea what the quest content of the mark was. Therefore, if players proceed with too many quests at the same time, it is often difficult to determine the exact location of the quest players want to proceed because of the numerous quest marks displayed on the compass. This is where Compass Navigation Overhaul comes in and solves the problem. Compass Navigation Overhaul is a very innovative mod because it can solve problems like this. It can output any language, so there is no need to translate. In addition to the quest mark for all marks displayed on the compass, the distance and the area name of the mark are also displayed. Compass Navigation Overhaul is a SKSE plugin, and since there is no ESP file, you can install and remove it at any time during the game. Therefore, I highly recommend this mod to any Skyrim player who wants to improve their navigation experience. It's a simple mod, but it can make a big difference in how you play the game. And that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this showcase of some of the hidden SKSE gems that will make your Skyrim more convenient. These mods are not very popular or well known, but they can make a big difference in your gameplay and quality of life. Whether it's saving time, managing your inventory, customizing your UI, or improving your performance, these mods have something for everyone. If you want to try them out for yourself, you can find the links to all the mods in the description below. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please leave a like and subscribe for more Skyrim mod reviews. Also, let me know in the comments what are some of your favorite hidden gems that make your Skyrim more convenient. I would love to hear your suggestions and feedback. Until next time, stay safe and have fun.